Today I have got my post Christmas backlog update for December 2023 and again the backlog is very much out of control but at least for 2024 I do have at least one thing canceled and that is the winter village set for 2024 because knowing the pattern for the winter village sets and the alpine lodge shouldn't retire until at least the end of 2025 so that thankfully allows me to keep that out of the budget for next year and I am really close to getting the Avengers Tower, so that's going to be probably a very early 2024 pickup, preferably with the Vintage Vehicle promo. And then my only other pickups for 2024 set-wise are actually the Loop Coaster and the Spider-Man art set. And that's pretty much it for just overall videos because for hauls because I want my 100th haul to be something special for the channel so that's why 2024 is pretty much just going to be single set hauls or really small hauls so that the budget's mostly intact for this Christmas time when we hit 100 and also I'll be doing probably dropping my rewards points around Christmas next year I've already pretty much planned that out with where my points are sitting right now I could drop those right now with the upcoming promo for January if that is when they do the vintage vehicle and pretty much cover the Avengers Tower no problem. But I don't want to. Because I'd cover like half of it. And I would just be able to pretty much easily use my Christmas money and birthday money and all that. And get that no problem. Plus probably six pack of Series 25 CMFs. But I'll just go for the Avengers Tower no problem but overall for sealed things in the collection it's pretty much just pretty much the same as past years that you guys have pretty much everything that you've seen in the past hauls over the past three years or so starting off from that Harry Potter Forbidden Forest set and the Jurassic Park or Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom set that's back all the way back from Hall 48. And so, yeah. So, technically, the halls are... The backlog started all the way back in 2019 before Christmas. So this is four years of backlog which the backlog was doing pretty good up until about 2020 and then it just exploded and it's gotten bigger each year mainly the things that have just sat have been the Christmas sets each year which we've got the holiday Main Street gingerbread house Santa's Visit, and then I'm counting the Home Alone set as a Christmas set because once I do get around to a Winter Village, that's where that's going to go. So we've got the 2019, 2021, and 2022 Winter Village sets, and then all of the wintertime GWPs that'll be added in to my Winter Village at some point the winter, the other 
Christmas double points promo from this past December, the Christmas ornaments. Those, I don't know what I'll do with them, probably keep them sealed. The horse and carriage, though, that'll probably be opened once the winter, winter village is actually started. And then we do have a few of the VIP add-on packs as well. So that, those will be, I don't know if they'll be opened or not. And then we've got the Winnie the Pooh Lego Ideas set, Speed Champion set from last Christmas, which I think is now, I think the Aston Martin is actually on the retiring list for Speed Champions, so I don't know if I'll keep it sealed or not. I did keep that first Speed Champion set sealed, but compared with that one and this one, I did actually have a plan for this Speed Champion set before the city just decided it was going to get redesigned. So, we've got that, and then we have all three of the Indiana Jones sets still sealed in their boxes. And I do plan to build the large one and the fighter plane chase set for sure and then tucked in there as well we do also have the 2024 modular natural history museum which i want to build that really bad but before i build that i'm gonna to have to do a major thing for the city at least for the downtown and that is going to be redesigning the entire downtown and residential area so most of the downtown has been shifted but the residential area still has to get shifted so that's where the city is like completely a disaster right now so right now there isn't a whole ton of projects going on but overall we've just got a lot of things sitting in the backlog at the moment. A lot of promos. I think I counted like 19 different promos over the past. I think, I think all of these are from like the past two years. Most of them are from the past year, which is kind of crazy. Other than a handful of them. And then I was just getting most of the promos over either double points or just a really good GWP, mainly the Pirate Island and the Christmas ones, or the vintage vehicle one, which I did get the moving truck earlier in the year, but that one was added into the city. But overall, this is what I've got for the city backlog that needs to be built most of this is actually needing to go into the city or just started with the christmas village or just other things mainly with that harry potter set from 2020 or 2019 or something i do have the parts to actually switch out that tree base finally so i could start that so we'll see if I get that started, because that's actually not even to go into the park or the downtown. That's actually meant to be added to the castle layout. So that is actually a set that I could open. And I've been meaning to open it, but I just needed to get parts so that I could swap out the tree base, because that just didn't match with the tree areas over by the castle. So... That's pretty much what we've got for 2023 backlog update for you guys. So you guys can tell me your thoughts on this video in the comment section below. And just like and subscribe for more because I will do more in the future.